Right, this is our Dojo Go. Uh, just do a quick one penny payment on P, confirm, tap on the back, and that should confirm. Works off Wi Fi and 4G. If we just want to print a quick customer street, there we go, prints off. Uh, then, if we then want to actually see that transaction, look at the side there. You can see the transactions for the day. There's the penny. Uh, you can, if you open it up, you can then reverse it should you so wish or reprint the receipt. Okay, so if we go back to sale, uh, if we want to do a card not payment present, three, three little buttons at the top there, select card not present, and then go through the normal addition of the card number, um, any relevant address details or name details that you might want to actually uh, record. That will then actually confirm the transaction. That's just declined because I've obviously got backed out of it. Now, if you then want to look at your um, transactions for the day, there they all are. You can then open one up. If somebody comes back and lost a receipt and needs to reprint it, you can or reverse the charge from there. You'll also need a security code to do that. Um, at the end of day summary, I'll just take the code so you don't see the code. You can now see the, the transactions for the day and you then to print them off you just that's the end of day summary complete pretty much as simple as that if you have to go over the 45 pounds limit you put the card in here and if you have a card that's outside the ec there's a swipe across the top here that's pretty much it